was up. My sister is not around. Ah, uh -uh, she's not. But we agreed to meet up today now. Ah, come on. You're a guy, man. Okay? Why are you acting up? Why are you acting as if you are not happy to see me? Any idea of where she went to? I don't know. I'm the only one at home. Okay, maybe I'll just chill and wait for her. Okay? Your room is well arranged and neat like this. With love bed sheets. What's happening? Please don't scatter that bed. I'm expecting someone. Who? Josephine. Josephine or Joseph? Josephine. Like you are expecting a girl in your room. You. She's just my classmate. But she's a she, isn't she? It's not what you're thinking. She just wants you to teach her something in math. Mathematics. Like you want to add and subtract. <laughs> well, I have see, see. I'm not thinking anything, okay? Um, you're a big boy and you need to enjoy your life while you're long, while you're still young, okay? Um, so just you just have to be careful and use your head, okay? And well, let me get going so that I don't interrupt anything, okay? Uh, but, like, but like I said, be careful. Exam guide UTM challenge. I will be given the sum of 100,000 Naira cash. Wow. Congratulations. Thank sir. you, Mom. Congrats. Josh. You know, it's actually a double congratulation. If you are coming, a few minutes ago, you would have heard the news. Your name was announced as the second best in UTME exam. What? I'm telling you. My son, I'm proud of you. I'm very proud of you. Thank you, Mom. You see, I couldn't have asked for a better child. You are bright. You are brilliant. You are handsome. You got fearing. You see, I'm not surprised by your achievements because you're a child of God and God is working out a great plan for you. He has a great plan for you. See, my son, you are going to be great. Just keep making us proud and above all, bring honor to Jesus. Congratulations. Thank you, Mom. You are the best parent in the world. Oh! My Congrats. Thank you, Mom. Your dad will get to hear this. Hmm. Justin, baby, I was coming to your house. I have news for you. Same here. I was also coming to your house. I have news for you. Wow. My news is going to be bigger than yours. <laughs> Definitely not. Really? Okay, let's hear yours. Uh, Joshua, I missed my period. Period? Yes. What does that supposed to mean? Joshua, I'm pregnant. Pregnant? For who? For you, of course. I see us in this question. Can I judge you? Me? I have rejected in Jesus' name. Where? When? How? Joshua, 12th of August, exactly 2 p.m. at your house. That should be a Monday. Jesus, I'm finished. Something that lasts for one minute. 
Ah! Someone should wake me up. I must be dreaming. It is what it is. I just came to inform you. But this meeting is over. Obina, you have finished me. This has nothing to do with me. I'm not the one pregnant for you. But you encouraged me to have fun, didn't you? But you enjoyed it, didn't you? For just one minute. And now my life is about to be ruined. <laughs> calm down. Just calm down. Your life isn't going to be ruined. Girls of nowadays can't be trusted. I am sure you are not the only one she has left with. She could be pregnant for anybody. What do you mean? What I'm saying is that we need to confirm if you are responsible for the pregnancy. I know a doctor who can help us. Just invite her for a test. What if she refuses coming for the test? See, just tell her you want to confirm if truly she is pregnant. But when she comes, the doctor will perform a prenatal paternity test to confirm if truly you are responsible for the pregnancy. I will settle everything with the doctor. You have nothing to worry about. Where do we get the money to run such tests? Don't worry, I've got you covered. Just ensure she comes for the test. God, please, give me a second chance. Wallahi, I will not mess up again. What do you mean you're not coming? Why should I? Should be I've done the pregnancy test that you want me to do. What else do you want? Go and verify now, so you don't believe me. The doctor specifically instructed that we both come back to get the result for the test. Joshua, and I said I am not coming with you. Ah, what is it? Is it by force? Hm. See, the earlier you realize what has happened and take full responsibility for it, the better for you. Please, please excuse me. Jesus, Jesus, what have I done to myself like this? Calm down. Calm down, there is light at the end of the tunnel. Don't lose hope yet. Which tunnel, sir? Your words don't make sense to me. Calm down, God will vindicate you. From the sins I committed? No, from the lie. I don't believe you are responsible for this pregnancy. Just calm down. This guy is calling. Hello? Okay, you are here? Where are you? I can't see you now. Oh, okay, okay. So just come forward, eh? See me? Yes, yes. I'm waving at you. Just come. come. Yeah. So just calm down. It's nothing, okay? The driver is here. We'll just go in and check this in the water for us, okay? Good day. Where is Josephine? She said she was not coming, that I should come to confirm that she's pregnant for me. Please, sir, tell me I'm not responsible for her pregnancy. How old are you? 18 years old, sir. Do you have a job? No, sir. Do you stay alone? She stays with his parents, doctor. 
just finished secondary school. Well, you're not responsible for the pregnancy. Ah! Thank you for saving me. Thank you, my Lord. Joshua. Thank you Alan, for saving me. Thank you, my Lord. Joshua. Ah, thank you, Jesus. Doctor, thank you. Shall I tell you? I know these girls. After getting pregnant for one useless guy out there, they will look for who? One innocent guy to just put it on. See, you have to thank me for saving you from this stuff. You need to wait and hear the other results before you start thanking Jesus, me, or your friend. Because there seems to be a much bigger problem here. What is it, sir? Josephine tested HIV positive. I am afraid you might have contracted the virus through sexual intercourse with her. Jesus! Jesus! <sighs> Inside where? You can't go inside, oh. What is going on, babe? <laughs> babe, who is your babe? What's happening? Are you going to teach me maths or not? Sorry, I can't teach you maths. Where are you going to? <laughs> where do you think I'm going to with the Bible? Thank you. 